What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough. Okay, so, we're here, we're finally strong, we're pumped up and everything, yes, we are ready. It is time for us to go to the gym, and yes, you're not mistaken on this last, in this, uh, this, uh, this whole title right here. Gym battle number four against Erica. It's only one gym battle right now because uh, there's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, there's like about seven trainers there plus Erica. So yeah, and uh, well, Erica is a grass type gym leader, and yes, her Pokemon are going to be very, very strong. So make sure to have Pokemon at least up to level 25 to 28 because uh, yeah, she's going to be very, very strong now. What you need is a Pokemon to use Cut in order to get to the gym right here. As you can see, we got ourselves our Beedrill. Breaking that too. And, uh, well, let's see. We're just going to be going on right here. And, uh, well, as you can see, there's this little pervert right here. He's like, hey, 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 this gym is, is great. It's full of women. Okay. And, uh, as you can see, the Celadon City Pokemon Gym Leader Erica, the nature-loving princess. Okay. So if you guys are just joining me in this episode right now, now the reason why we're barely battling her, or, or Erica, on the 22nd, 23rd episode of our walkthrough, it's because we took a side quest to get stronger. I switched up a few Pokemon, used up a few things, got a little bit, you know, sidetracked with Patrick and all that stuff, but we're finally strong enough to take on Erica. We took on the main things, and now it is time to be the very best that we can be. So here we go, Celadon City Gym Leader. Erica is the leader, and of course, Gary has won this this gym battle right here. So what you need are Fire-type, Flying-type, Poison-type Pokemon, and uh, for the occasional, uh, what was it called, Grass-slash-Poison-type Pokemon, don't forget to use those Psychic-type Pokemon. And if you do have an Ice-type move, you know, if you do have an Ice-type move lying around there, you know, it's always nice to use them. Hey, don't forget bug types. Bug types are pretty nice too, right? I guess. So here we go, guys. First battle. I should tell you about this gym. Only real ladies are allowed in here. Okay. I wonder how Ash got into the last one. Oh, yes. He, <laughs> he picked he was a woman. Okay, so here we go. Battling up against Last K. And she is coming out with her bell sprout. Here is Godzilla looking like a big ass snack right here. Oh, yes. Look at that. Oh yes. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna make quick work of these people right here. I may have over leveled my Pokemon just a little bit, but you know what? I'd rather take uh, take care of the long stuff before we go into the main stuff right here, which is the gym battles. And uh, <laughs> yeah buddy, I like to be in control. Look at that. Oh yes. <laughs> Say goodbye to that one. Okay. And Polyswag level 32 awesome and he's like and she's like you're too rough no I'm not all right so I don't care we're just gonna destroy everybody with the same Pokemon oh welcome I was getting bored you were really just a little bit bored okay alrighty so here we go we're gonna be going up against another Pokemon trainer her name is beauty and she has herself a Godzilla or no an oddish so let's go ahead and use fly Flying like an eagle, because we can. Flying like an eagle, yes we can. Look at that. Oh yes. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Look at that. And uh, Polly Swag's looking cool. I'm just gonna continue on right here with Godzilla. I know I'm kind of like hitting the border with uh, with a level restriction, but you know what? We will be able to beat uh, Erica by the time. We hit level 40. So here we go. Fly. Misses. Good God. We get paralyzed. Oh, this is always nice. You know, getting paralyzed. Fuck me, right? Yeah. Okay, so there it is. A, uh, that attack. And then here we go. Godzilla with a fly attack for the win. That's right. Eat that. Stick that in your pipe and smoke it. And she's coming out with an oddish. So... I'm going to give Godzilla a little break and go with Executumon right here. And, uh, yeah, I think we should be good right here. We should. We should be good. So, Executumon, looking pretty awesome. Here we go, Confusion. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 
And like I said in the last episode, guys, Executumon is has been a godsend because it's the complete opposite of what uh, Patrick was. Useful. Very, very useful right here. And look at that. A confusion attack yet again. Mousesprout has been defeated. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And oh, yeah. She's like, my makeup! <laughs> oh, man. I am the king of the world right here. I am the lord of you girls. Uh, okay, so let's go ahead and use that full heal on this on this guy, and uh, there we go. Full heal, and uh, let's see. Well, we let's go right let's go right ahead for out like the outside stuff. Um, let's see. You know what? Let, let's just keep it with uh, Charizard and Executor. And here's another beauty, and she's like, look, look, see my Pokemon. I like the grass type. I like how they are easy to raise. Well, I guess they are very easy to raise. So here we go, another battle going up against Beauty Tamiya, and she's coming out with her bell sprout right here. And uh, Godzilla, ready, set, go! Flamethrower right here. Oh yes. Alrighty. Okay. Look at that bell sprout. Destroyed, defeated. Gattaca. And uh, we're just gonna continue on right here. Oh my god, it's just this big ass dragon looking like Pokemon destroying everybody. I'm happy. I'm very, very happy. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. I, I'm I'm very happy that I, I made the decision to switch Patrick. It has worked. It has really, really worked. Depend like the, despite some of you guys' protests and everything. I'm I know that many of you guys don't pro like probably don't even like Executor. But you know what? It's working for me. Uh, like, you guys already know. You guys already know that I'm a football coach. In any good football team or any team out there, you need good chemistry. And uh, I don't think I've ever told or mentioned this before, but yeah, we won three straight, three straight section championships from where I'm from, and it all had to do with great chemistry and great talent and all that stuff. And that's exactly what I have right here: great chemistry and great talent. That's right. Now I'm now I'm trying to figure out what the last Pokemon is for me. Who do you think I should use, guys? I have a feeling what you guys what you guys want is what I already have. I kind of don't want to use, but I may have to use. We'll have to see. Okay, so here we go. Flamethrower for the win. Okay, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That's right. And uh, Polyswag defeated. And she's like, you're an eye-opener. Yes, baby, I am. Okay, so... Let's see. Got another trainer right here. She should be number C. Letter C. And, uh... Let's go right ahead and do this. Welcome to the Celadon Gym! You'd better not underestimate the nice ladies here. I'm not really underestimating you girls. I'm just, you know... Thinking that you guys probably picked the wrong Pokemon to battle me with. So, here we go. Another five Pokemon. And uh, I'm going to go straight for flies. That's right. You can't catch me with the stun spore that you want to hit me with. So here we go. Fly attack for the win. Oh, yes. Bellsprout defeated. Alrighty. Okay. Look at that. And she's going to be coming out with another Oddish. So let's go right ahead and stay with the same Pokemon we got. Flamethrower. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That sounds like... That sounds like a real fun time right there. A real, real good time right there. And uh, Polyswag is just like sitting around, not doing anything, just enjoying the experience points it's gaining right there. So here we go, fly attack. Okay. And, uh, alrighty, so here we go, fly attack for the win. Yeah, buddy. That's how you do it. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. And she's going to be coming out with a Gloom, so let's go ahead and uh, switch it out to Executmon. Just trying to conserve a few moves here and there for the last battle right here. And uh, she's wondering, why are you using an Executor? This is why. Confusion. For the win. And it doesn't survive. Yeah, it doesn't survive at all. Sadly, some of these Pokemon have Poison-type capabilities, so that's easy pickings for Executmon. And, uh... 
Well, let's go right ahead and use that confusion yet again. Oh, yes. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Takes you, takes your soul to the Shadow Realm. And Polly Swag grows to level 35, or 33. My bad. And she's like, oh, beaten. That's right. You've been beaten, young lady. Okay, so, let's see. Uh, oh, okay. Well, this should be easy right here. And she's looking at me right now. She's like, pleased to meet you. My hobby, po my hobby is Pokemon training. So is mine. Okay. Let's go. What's next? Um, oh, look at that. She, she will be having an execute. Okay, so here we go. Pokemon training forever. Let's go. Let's get it with a fly attack right here. We're going to destroy you. Easy, see, easy stuff. And, uh, well, there's a fly attack. Will it do it? Does it do it? Will it do it? Can it do it? That's how you do it. Look at that. Polyswag. Not doing anything at all. Just, uh, you know, getting experience points and all that stuff. And splendid. Okay, so we got one more trainer here. And, uh, you know what? I'm going to save that for you right here, Executimon. You're going to be doing the work, and then the rest is easy. So, here we go. Oh, hey! We don't like bug or fire type Pokemon in here. Okay. We'll see what happens. So here we go. Last Lisa wins the battle and she's coming out with her Oddish and I'm coming out with Executimon. Alright, Executimon, do your thing. Confusion. That's right. As you can see, Oddish getting its butt kicked badly. Look at that. And uh, look at that. Level 33. Pokemon are growing well. Very, very well. And so, she's going to be coming out with another Gloom. So, let's finish this off right here with Confusion. Alrighty. Alrighty. And uh, that is how you do it. Say goodbye. Okay. Alrighty. And look at that. Last Lisa is like, oh, you? So, you girls are done. Whew. It's been uh, quite some time, guys. But, it's finally time. To take on our rival, Godzilla. Nah, I'm just playing. It's time to take on uh, Erica right here, and uh, well, let's see what she has to say. Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome, my name is Erica. I am the leader of the Celadon Gym. I am a student of uh, the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are solely of the grass type. Oh, I'm sorry, I had no idea you wished to challenge me. Very well. But I shall not lose. It's probably not how she said it, but you know, you guys get what I'm trying to say. Oh God, it's been a while since I've I've heard this song. Thank you, Jeebus. Let's do this. That's right. Let's go. Leader Erica wants the battle, and she's coming out with her victory bell. And here's Godzilla. So moving on to the next screen right here, as you can see. Gym Leader Erica. It's been damn near 10 episodes. And uh, here she is. She has three different Pokemon. Two of which are combo Pokemon of Grass and Poison type Pokemon. She starts off with Victory Belt at level 29. It has Stun Spore, Acid, Poison Powder, and Giga Drain. The next Pokemon it has is Tangela at level 24. Poison Powder, Constrict, Ingrain, and Giga Drain are its attacks. And in its final Pokemon, Vileplume, and it also has Sleep Powder, Acid, Stun Spore, and Giga Drain. Now, the biggest thing right here is that all three of these Pokemon have Chlorophyll. And as we all know, Chlorophyll boosts up the speed of any kind of Grass-type Pokemon. The other thing, too, Stun Spore will try and paralyze you. And as you guys, many, as many of you guys already know in the last few episodes, Poison Pokemon. Now, they do have Giga Drain, and it works a little bit better in the sunlight. So you guys got to be aware of that kind of stuff right there. So... The Pokemon you need to use right here, very simple. For pure grass type Pokemon, you can use bug type Pokemon, fire type, flying type, ice type Pokemon. It doesn't say that right there on the whole thing right here, but you can also use poison type Pokemon. Now, if you have combo Pokemon like Victory Bell and, and Vileplume, make sure to have a psychic type Pokemon here and there. You know, it, it could work. There's still poison type Pokemon. Remember that. Okay. So let's go back to the screen right here. Let's go right ahead with fire. Flamethrower. Oh, yes. That's right. Feel the flame of Godzilla. 
no chance whatsoever. Look at that. I'm dominating you. That's right, level 38. And uh, Polyswag gaining levels without nothing. So let's just continue right here with Godzilla. And uh, you know what? Let's screw around with them a little. Fly attack. Oh, yes. And uh, she's going to try and constrict me, but that won't work. So here we go. Fly attack. Oh, yes. Tangela defeated. Fatality. And uh, yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. She's coming out with her vile plume. And let's stay with Godzilla. All right, you stinking, stinking vile, vile plume. Flamethrower. Oh, yes. Very flamethrowerist. Oh, yes. And that is how you do it, guys. After kicking butt outside of uh, the gym, we're kicking butt right here. Look at that. And she's like, oh, I can see defeat. You are remarkably strong. I must confer to you the rainbow badge. And uh, we get extra Mula for that. That's good. That's good. And uh, the rainbow badge will make Pokemon up to level 50 obey. It also allows Pokemon to use strength in and out of battle. Please also take this with you. Get ourselves the TM-19, which is Giga Drain. Half the damage it inflicts is drained and to heal your Pokemon. Wouldn't you agree with that? Or that, that it's a wonderful move? Yes, it is. Okay, so talk to this again. So she's like, you are cataloging Pokemon. I must say I'm impressed. I would never collect Pokemon if they were unattractive. Hmm. Wow, you, 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 you're really a cool person right there. Whatever. Okay, so... That is pretty much it right there, guys. Uh, it's been a while, but look at that, guys. Four badges. We're halfway there. And luckily for us, we can actually go in for our fifth badge because we've already completed all the main stuff to get to Fuchsia City, including the Safari Zone thing. So what we're going to do is we're going to go straight to the Pokemon Center and heal up, feel good about ourselves, and then, uh, yeah, maybe, just maybe, uh, take care of other business, too. So... I'm going to go straight to the Pokemon Center, and I'm going to be right here. I'm going to stand right here. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for being super patient. I will be back in the next episode for Pokemon Leaf Green. See you guys.